Hey everybody, what's up? This is PC Hacker 11, and this video is going to be demonstrating a cool piece of software I found called Ultramon. Now, uh, Ultramon is a program that will let you manage dual monitors, but uh, this software is not free. So, uh, as you can see, I have two monitors open right now, and uh, basically what Ultramon does is it extends the taskbar from your main monitor to your second monitor. So as you can see down here in my main monitor I have my start menu and my Firefox window open and over here in my second monitor I just have my uh, Windows Explorer window open. Now sorry if I'm keep looking up it's just my monitors are uh, ones on the top shelf, ones on the bottom shelf. So anyway so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and fade the webcam out now so I can just start the review of Ultramon. So anyway Ultramon is a software that you can download from this website, realtimesoft.com slash Ultramon. And uh, you can download the uh, real version or the uh, test beta version. I downloaded the beta version, but uh, they're still uh, not exactly free. You have to buy them. I'm using the trial right now, so uh, I'm just using the trial of it right now. But anyway, basically what happens when you launch Ultramon is it'll create this smart taskbar here in your second monitor. As you can see I have this little uh, icon here that says Explore. That basically means that I'm running my uh, Explore window inside of the second monitor. And so uh, if I was to go down here and launch up like a Firefox window it would, uh, would launch Firefox. Just wait for it to launch for now. So it launches Firefox in the second monitor. Now, uh, I mean, not in the second, the first monitor. But uh, once Ultramon launches up, it has these. It adds these two little commands up to the bar up here. There's this command and there's this command. If we click on this one right here, it full screens it and takes advantage of the real estate of having both monitors and has it full screen up within both monitors. But uh, I don't really like that, so I keep it mostly just full screen inside of one monitor. Now uh, you can take and drag the windows in between monitors like before and as you can see I have Firefox open in the second monitor now and it's in the smart taskbar but uh, it's not completely even out within the resolution so if we want to move this window into the second monitor and have it have just a complete and normal resolution we can click on this button up here it'll move it to the second monitor and it will adjust the resolution of the window to fit the second monitor because uh, if you're like me and both your monitors are different resolutions then this will come in handy so I'm gonna click that now uh, if we go up in the second monitor as we notice the uh, minimize commands will just minimize the explorer to the open available space in the smart taskbar. So the smart taskbar is basically just an area to uh, it basically acts like the taskbar so you won't have to have too many commands lined up in your main taskbar and they'll be open in the second monitor so it's re it really increases multitasking. I thought dual monitors increased multitasking but uh, Ultramon really increases multitasking. So I'm gonna go ahead and close all the windows so uh, uh, yeah, just lost my mouse there for a second. So uh, anyway, when you launch up Ultramon, it comes up to this little icon here in the system tray. If we click on it, it brings up to all these commands. In the general window, it has the uh, Windows management and all these commands. In the smart taskbar, it, uh, it uh, has the commands for the smart taskbar. In the buttons and menu commands here, we have hotkeys, uh, one for ignored monitors. As you can see, monitor one's below monitor two, and uh, you have all these different commands up here. So, anyway, that is my quick review of Ultramon. Uh, thanks a lot for watching, guys. You can download Ultramon from this website. You can download the trial of it, or you can buy the real version. I'll put the link to the site in the description. So, this has just been my quick review of Ultramon. So, thanks for watching, guys. This has been a video from PC Hacker 11, so thanks for watching again, and I'll see you guys.